review with discretion is that motherfucking vibes, girl. everybody, it's Steve-O. I'm over at Hank's house. Um, I just came on here because I just had a few things to say. Um, number one being gay men and not wanting to be in relationships, okay? This is really irritating me. Come on, man. Come on now. Because I'm getting sick and tired of going to the bar, going out and trying to look for a date. I get on a date and the first thing they want to do is get in my fucking pants. No. No, that's not how it's working, okay? I want a boyfriend. You ain't just gonna take me out to fucking Applebee's and think you're getting in my fucking pants right away, okay? I want a man. I'm a little old-fashioned about who I want. I want a man who is out, first of all, have to have the four C's as well. Cash, crib, car, college, education, okay? Thank you. And also, I want a man who's gonna love me for who I am. I want a man to come home to and just look at me and just say I love you as soon as I walk in the door. I miss you, baby. How was your how was your day at work? You know, that's what I want. I want to come home and cuddle up on the couch with my man. I want to come home and watch a movie. I want to come home to someone who loves me. I want to feel that again. And I'm tired of finding all these men who say one thing about how they want to be in a relationship and this, that, and the third, but they don't want to be in a real, they don't want to be in a relationship. They just want to be all up in your uh, fucking anus. No, that's not how it's working, boo-boo, okay? I'm tired of it. I'm tired of it. Gay men, get it together. Get it together. Because being, just because you're gay doesn't mean you have to go around and fuck every little floozy who come your way. It's time to man up and uh, start looking at, looking for something more than just a hookup. Like, what's going on? I just want to know because... I'm just looking, I, I'm looking around, and I, it might be my area, but I doubt it. Um, because all the men around here, they just trying to play games and say, oh, yeah, I'm really looking for a relationship, blah, 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 blah. And by the end of the day, it's all about saying, so you want to go back to my place. No, I don't want to go back to your place. I thought we were having a good time, and now you just ruined it. Because, look, I may love sex, but... It, <laughs> I want it to be more meaningful, okay? I want, it to, I want sex to be from somebody who I love, okay? I could go out today and get me sex, but that's not what I want. That's not what I want. I want a relationship. I want somebody to love me for who I am. I want to come home and just feel that. I want to be with somebody. I don't want to just, okay, well, that was fun. Thanks. Bye. No, I'm tired of that. I'm too old for that. That's old. That's old. Come on, man. Where you at? Where you at? Because I live in Potsdam, Pennsylvania. If there's any man out there who is actually looking for a real relationship, hit me the fuck up because it could be one and popping. Okay? Because I'm tired of this. I'm tired of it. I, I work my ass off. I got my shit together. I just got my hair done. I'm looking good. Like, come on now. Where, where, where are these men at? Where are the men? I'm tired of these little boys. I'm tired of them. They can go somewhere. These little boys. Okay? I, I, I don't want these little boys. I want a man. A man. And, and when I say man, I don't mean you coming to me saying you want to be in a relationship and I'm taking care of your ass. A relationship is 50-50. Okay? 50-50. If not, you taking care of me. Okay? Because I don't take care of nobody. I'm nobody's bankroll. Okay? I don't, I don't do that. I don't play that. I'm not your ride. I'm not your chauffeur. I'm not. I'm not your free ride. I am not. I. I, I am not hosting you for room and board. I want a man, a 50-50 relationship, a loving relationship where we're equals and we love each other. That's what I'm looking for. And I want to know where you men at. Secondly, that that was the one thing I wanted to talk about is I want a man. Okay. Number two. Okay. Now. My current living situation is I live in a house with my cousin and my brother, okay? 
Now, it's my mom's house, and she had asked me to take over the mortgage, okay? So I took over the mortgage, and the mortgage is $1,400 a fucking month. Why the fuck is there three people living in my house, and I'm the only one fucking paying? And I'm getting tired of it because they feel entitled to shit. Bitch, where the fuck do you think the cable, internet, phone, all that come from? Where the fuck do you think your cell phone come from that's in my motherfucking name? Huh? Do you think that just up here? Do you, do you, do you believe that that, that, that that's just magically on all the time? Do you, do you believe that the food in the kitchen just, oh, just appears like I dream a fucking genie? No. That comes out of my pocket and you need to start fucking paying. I'm getting tired of it, tired of it. This is what I'm talking about. People need to grow the fuck up and realize that it's the 21st fucking century, okay? And, and you need to get your ass a job and start paying your fucking bills. How are you going to live in a household and bumming off your family? Bitch, please, I'm paying $1,400 a month for this shit. I I ain't a billionaire. The hell I look like paying all that money for a house. Okay, I could be in my, I could have my ass in a one bedroom apartment for six fifty, and you got me up here in this house paying for all your shit. Like I want to know what's going on. What is the tea? So I had to cuss my cousin out last night, and Lord have mercy, he is lucky I know Jesus because I was about to tear his head off because he think he entitled to this, that, and the third. Where the fuck do you think the car you're driving is mine? The car. Is mine. The insurance on it? Me. Okay? Everything is me. That cell phone you carry around because you just had to have an iPhone and you swore to the Lord that you was going to be paying for it. And I'm paying for it. That's $140 a month per phone. Okay? We got three of them. Do the math. Too much damn money. So, house, bills, food, all that shit, all out of my pocket? Getting tired of it, getting tired of it. They about to hit the street, girl. My mom's going to have to take, go into fucking uh, bankruptcy because I ain't doing it no more. I ain't doing it no more. I'm, I've been on apartment hunting all day because I'm done with it. I'm done with it. I'm not doing it no more. Okay. On a lighter note. I, I, I decided to change up my hair, as you can see. It's not long. It's short. It's... Definitely not blind no more. And I decided to change it up because I wanted to do something different. I don't know if I like it or not, but I'm, I'll get used to it. And I don't know. I've been just, you know, chilling. You know, I'm over here at Pank's house. And, you know, he he's somewhere. And I don't know where he at right now. I just walked in the door because the bitch got a key. And decided to come and do a video. Okay? I just wanted to keep up with you guys. You know, I haven't done a video in a minute. So I decided to come and do a video. But what do you guys think about my hair? I love, I, I kind of like it. I'm getting used to it. I, I, I don't know. It's short. It's different. I haven't worn short hair in a minute. Okay, so this is, this is something. But I don't know. What has everybody been up to? Um, I don't know if everybody was on Tiny Chat or whoever watches my videos was on Tiny Chat with Ty and I a couple weeks ago. But we had spoken out about uh, wanting to start our own show on YouTube, uh, the two of us together. Um, I would love to hear your guys' feedback on that uh, to see if you think, if you would watch. And uh, the, we want to do, you know, topics, you know, uh, things that are going on in the world, things like that. We're going to be the view, but better. Okay? Um, but yes, I, I want your opinions on that. Uh, I would love for you guys to, uh, to give us topics. You know, so we can so we can read them on our show and we can, uh, you know, just discuss it. But other than that, I'm just chilling. You know, I'm just trying to do me. I'm trying to get, I'm trying to get uh, all this stuff out of my head, child. These these children that I live with are pissing me off. Okay, this is why I need a man. I need somebody to bitch to. When I bitch you, I just need somebody. I need somebody who's there for me. I'm tired of being for everybody else. I do too much for everybody, and I ain't got shit for myself, okay? I need somebody for me. I need a man. I need somebody to love. I want to feel the love. You know, I just need to, I need somebody for me, because I do for everybody. I don't ask for nothing return, in return, but I would love to have something in return. I would love to come home and say, hear somebody say, I love you. But that's it for today, okay? You guys have a great day, um, and ta-da.